struggles a little bit with disjoints, and Cloud has the best in the game. Then again, uh, when it comes uh, to comboing, Mario does a number on Cloud, and he also has a couple of really weird gimp tools like the Flood, like the Cape, that were better on Cloud than most characters. Yeah, and uh, Skipper has faced multiple Clouds today only, uh, only today already. I studying played Cloud versus him, and so did S1. Yeah, so he is he is the he is warm for Cloud. Yeah, Mario versus Cloud is the name of the game today. Oh, there it is, Skipper with the combos. Already 66% on Asriel, but he is striking back immediately. Just look at these juggles, man. Oh, the air dodge read into another limit broken cross slash, and Mario's out. Asriel is has, has been using these limits very professionally. Oh, speaking of air dodge reads, what 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 is this? Not even a minute gone, and both of these characters are already out of their first stock. Just incredible plays by the both of them. Both of them dying early. These these are these are very scary players, you know. <laughs> Me personally, I struggle the most with aggressive. Oh, look look at these yeah. look at these custom combos using the down air after the down throw for a re grab. Creative stuff by Skipper. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I personally struggle the most with aggressive playstyles, and these are some of the best aggressive players we have in the country. Oh, the whiff grab gets punished by a finishing touch on the platform. Of every part you could get hit on stage, you get oh. hit on the moving platform. Oh my. My I, lord. I had the exact same expression on my face as Skipper. Just eyebrows <laughs> raised. <laughs> like that worked? Oh! Yeah, yeah. ill faded down there means he had to burn the limit on recovery, but he's okay with that. I mean, look at this lead. Building and building. No, no up B. <laughs> and he up smashed the down air. Another one of the few moves in the game that actually can contest. Oh no, don't fall off with that Nair. Nah, no, he's gonna live, he's <laughs> gonna live. He, he ain't Greninja. <laughs> oh, trying for the good old roll behind grab, but Asriel not falling for it. He is trying to get out of the corner aggressively. Yeah, I, Mar I Ooh, Mario is looking for either of two things, being a grab or an yeah. up smash, but that back air off stage will definitely yeah. seal out that sock as well. I, I expected Asriel to... Oh, hello, another dunk? Hello, fair city. My boy, I I am having trouble having a conversation with you. <laughs> you know, you try to talk about something that's happening in the game, and then he just dunks a man. That's, uh, that's Ezreal. But always I'm glad they are giving us scary. something to talk about. Oh, definitely. Instead of, you know, two characters, one on top of the tree, on the other one at the bottom, just staring each other down. It's hard to talk about that. <laughs> it's hard. It's hard. <laughs> it's hard. So we are uh, glad we have some exciting matches in these final moments of this tourney. One of these two will have a shot at S1. And for me personally, I would like to see Ezreal have that shot because Skipper al already had his one. I, I'm, I'm excited to see what, what Ezreal can bring to the table. Yeah, well, let's find out. I mean, most important for him right now is to avoid getting grabbed. To get Mario in the air and he, he's been doing wonders. Just doing exactly that throughout the set. Mario doesn't have the most trouble landing, but uh, among top tiers, mm -hmm. he's not the greatest. He doesn't have a momentum switching move like Monkey Flip to help him out. Yo, yeah. It's Dunk City. Skipper loves that. As do we. There wasn't even an air dodge read or anything. No, he, he just down tilt up air dunk. Skipper. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Yeah, he's not being, yeah, just to be certain of it. Not being able to make that back and... That's what I was talking about. You get outspaced pretty hard with Mario versus Cloud. But uh, if you get him in a bad position just once... Mario is one of the best to just end the stock right away. Speaking of ending stocks right away. Another air door treat. Another forward smash. So you see that? You know, every opportunity this guy gets, he goes for <laughs> the dunk. <laughs> then again, he needs to do something crazy if he wants to... Uh, you know, yeah, get the, get the full stock lead away from Skipper. Make this one back and take the game as well. Alrighty. It is grab. a grab. But it's nothing. It's not by a back air. Oh, oh. No, 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 not gonna be able to do it. But getting no conversion either. And the limit actually <laughs> coming through with that last hit. Thankfully, with the Skipper, the platform had moved back just a little bit. And again, the fair off stage, Dunk. my lord. 
Okay, we have... Uh, okay, okay, okay. Four stocks have been lost. Three of them were dunks, and we got one flood yeah, game. We're not watching uh, Smash 4. We are watching M uh, NBA 2K16. Uh, Mario even wearing the Lakers outfit. So you know. <laughs> Lakers outfit. Yeah, this is basketball, people. No, if basketball was actually like this, I'd probably watch it more. <laughs> oh, no! Yeah! <laughs> Why? Every stock was taken with a dunk except for the flood. You gift. live by the dunk, you die by the dunk. Crap. <laughs> You know, I love that Flood Kim, but I almost wish that he finished the dunk with a four there instead of a cape. Then we would have had a full <laughs> game of dunks, man. <laughs> full game of dunks. Yeah, yeah, after the cape, yeah. go for the dunk as well. But! But! <laughs> <laughs> this complete savagery here in Losers Finals. Now I'm pretty sure this is a best of five. Yeah, this is a best of five. So we're oh, getting yeah. even more dunks. Ooh, I'm excited. Okay. Somebody get the dunk counter out here. Because we might need it here. Okay, Skipper starting off with a nice little grab. Of course, you can air dodge that final hit of the down air. But if you do, that's a frame tap. You land with air dodge lag and Mario gets a re-grab. And this is what follows. So just take the initial combo, people. It's not worth it. A solid Mario like Skipper will punish you on that air dodge. He will snuff that out and take it all the way. Look at that. 48, 99. Just from one or two wins in neutral. Ooh. But as we saw, Mario's life could be over in an instant. So this might look like a nice lead, but you never know with these two. Oh, he's looking for it. But stays on stage oh. this time as a mix-up. I got the air dodge read, but I guess he wasn't feeling the finish touch. Yeah, probably. Oh, there it was. He tried to stop him with limit broken cross legs, but Mario just grabbing him. Or finishing touch. Yo, the air dodge read, that was a bit of a silly air dodge from Skipper, as Ezreal had no way of following it, it up if he had not air dodged. But a back throw uh, will seal it out. Yeah. So it's, it's, it's prime time for Skipper again to get those crazy Mario The thing about Town of City is it has a shorter blast zone on the top, but also a slightly shorter blast zone on the side. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not as bad as Smashville, but it's still just a little bit closer to the side of the stage. And it is almost... Limit Broker, cross slash, punish the whip grab, and he is out. Yeah, beautiful DI though. Beautiful DI, might have lifted up Battlefield or Dreamland or whatever. But they chose Town of City, or rather, Asriel chose Town of City, and it seems to be working out for him, at least in terms of blast zones. Skipper, however, with the lead after just having the most explosive start. Mm -hmm. Alright, grab once again off stage for Cloud. Aggressive options are working out for him, but not with that finishing touch. Yeah, he wants it a little bit too much, I guess. Oh, no, he can punish that. And again, one of the few moves that actually beats Cloud's down air. Which is really good for Mario, otherwise he would have even more trouble getting inside Cloud's bubble. Four there. This if might you be space it correctly, it's actually unpunishable. And I like the way Ezreal has been mixing up his uh, ledge guard options. You know, getting aggressively off stage, yeah. uh, having a hitbox out when Mario gets back, fading back. Oh, here we go, here we go. Skipper with the combos. Oh, he misses the re-grab. Could have taken it much, much further. Yeah, but still has the lead. Yeah, he has a bit of wiggle room. He can afford to, to miss a grab here yeah, or there. Drop a combo. He's still in prime position to get a nice combo of 40 to 60%. But the, the real question is, do you want to make it that close versus a guy like Asriel? Oh, oh, oh. He air dodges through the flood for the most part. Trades with the grab with the first hit of cross slash. Having a, just a little bit of a hard time finishing off skipper stock. Forward tilt from the other side, not gonna do it. 171, you rarely see people live this long versus Mario. Bro, not quite yet. Not even on town and city, man. Definitely not as good as Martha Throw. Yeah. <laughs> it's a well, whole different league. No, no, then again, Mars Up Throw is one of the weaker kill throws in the game. And no, no, no. Oh, it, is that it with the down air? No. Not quite. Not even with Don't underestimate Mars, Mars uh, Up Throw. It, it's way better than it was in, the, in the melee, for instance. Yeah, I get it. But uh, it is definitely known as one of uh, the weaker kill throws. And at the start of Cloud's release, his Up Throw was actually, uh, you know, healed as a kill throw. Mm -hmm. But uh, when time 
passes, certain things become yeah, less it, relevant. All right, drops the combo. It's Ezreal's turn, yeah. turn now, but it doesn't last very long. And knowing Ezreal, as soon as he hits about 40-50%, he's gonna start looking for that finishing touch. That's the kind of guy Ezreal is. All right, gets the grab. Nair. Oh boy. It's a very scary situation for Ezreal. Oh yeah. And we see Skipper looking for the down air. Sh mm. Sharking with the down air because that last hit is surprisingly strong. Back throw is gonna try to force. That. Oh, oh, I like the idea. I guess a little bit too much rage or a little bit too high percent. Either way, at some percentages that is true. This time it's not happening for Ezreal. And now he is here alone versus Mario at 147 without limit. Back throw. Yeah. It's gonna That's do it. it. So, losers finals. Right now it's 2 1 in favor of Skipper. It is indeed. But Ezreal can still bring it back. Yeah, I'm just trying to think of where it went wrong. Was there a, a crucial moment? I don't think well, there was a. Uh, they actually went pretty even, but Skipper just started off with this huge, huge That's slice true. of momentum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Ezreal just could, couldn't really recover. So he's deciding to take it back to Smashville. He was never able to, to shift the momentum fully uh, to his side. He got it even a couple of times, but never, you know, uh, so much that he was able to take the game. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> we countering dunks with dunks out here. Okay, here goes Skipper. Oh, the platform actually saving Asriel from a big combo. Landing so he could shield. There it is! And you're out! Just like that. Couple of aerials in the mix and you're done. Nice little combo by Skipper. 72% pushes him off. That might have ended poorly for Ezreal, but luckily he's still alive. I love the little walking bits that Skipper does after landing a back air. Oh, nice down smash, taking that first hook of Ezreal. Only 4% on Skipper, not too bad. But yeah, you should notice when he is hitting a, uh, a back air that actually pushes uh, Cloud over the stage, so in the tech situation basically, then he will just walk towards. Right. He'll just slowly walk towards, so he still has all his options available. That's actually a nice, a nice little detail that Skipper is doing. As you may expect from a high level Mario, they all have their own quirks. They do. That, that, that's what I actually really... Oh, hello! Oh my god. Another dunk, and I swear to god, these things are true. There's no way he'd be hitting so <laughs> many of them if they weren't. Just knows the percentage, just knows the setup, and then, you know, damage ensues. Skipper had his final stock here in game four of Blue's finals. Fortunately for him, he is up by one. Blood online. Down air. Oh, he waited for the air dodge, but he landed on the platform. Yeah. Oh. oh, what? What is it? No. <laughs> Using the moving platform to end it in style. Finishing touch. Evening of the set two-two in Lunar Finals. Looking Man. like happy hour for. Cloud out Th here. This is one of the most entertaining sets I've watched in a long, long time. I it's very nice to see. But yeah, what I love about uh, top level Mario's, so, you know, Ally, Anti, Zenyu, they all play really, really different. I think it's cool to see how one, one top tier character like this can be, pre you know, relevant among multiple high level or top level players, and they still all have, you know, a very distinct style. Okay, so they are discussing stage bans right now. I don't see any of them switching characters. We know what happened to Ezreal's Madden Knight, and he is coming off of a win of game four with momentum. Mm -hmm. uh, Skipper, Mario, Falcon. Mario does a lot better versus Cloud. It's just, it's just the truth. So he's going to be staying with Mario. But he's going to be taken into what many argue as Cloud's worst stage, or at least Cloud's least Advantageous stage. What? FD? Yeah. But this I'm is not joking, man. This is Juggle Central for... It is Juggle Central, but he, uh, the, the reason why 
Battlefield is, is hailed as Cloud best stage. Is he can cover all those platforms so easily, yeah. extend his jobs with the platforms. But I think this, uh, FD is still a decent stage for Cloud. Yeah, but that's because every stage is decent for Cloud. Mm. Okay, Speaking but of juggles, but anyway, I, I yeah. What what's happening juggles, right now? Juggles go both ways. Ooh, and F smashes do as well. Yeah, the art of just standing still when people are closing in on you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> and they are swinging at each other. Yeah, they sure are. Nice little confirm with the neutral air. Yes, ooh, this time Skipper times the air dodge correctly. Up smash not quite, he needs one more. There it is. Jumping away from the stack. Hagen with the pair. He is getting Ezreal off stage, but he hasn't managed to gimp him, allowing Ezreal to live to these percentages, at which Rage cross slash becomes really scary. Mm -hmm. I don't know what he tried to do there, but uh, did not work out. What is the option he picks? It's a dash attack, oh. connecting but not doing the job just yet. G drops off with a Nair, actually giving up the stake for that. Right, snaps to ledge, very important. Oh, another dash attack and by Asriel. Indeed, but it's stale and the yeah. press oh, just Oh, that was so creative by, by, by Skipper. He noticed that whenever he was in the corner, he had a hard time getting out. It's super dangerous being at the ledge versus a cloud with cross slash. And he just did a wall jump and a B reverse fireball to shift his momentum back on the stage. Just. Excellent stuff by Skipper, but it did not help him take the first stock. That goes to Azrael with one of them back airs. Mm. And Cloud, 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 Cloud. Cloud, Cloud, Cloud. I was about to say on full rage, but that's luckily gone for Skipper. Yeah, getting a little bit too dash tech happy. They, they had been working out, but right there. Not so much. Skipper's looking for the grab. Goes for the up air, just one upper. It's actually pretty surprising. He probably uh, misinput the full hop right there. Just and up yeah, there it is after up tilt and he just does nothing when he knows it's Ezreal's chance to escape so he can just punish his escape option on reaction right smart stuff there it is that was not an auto cancel down air there it is skipper's just standing still whenever Ezreal's just hopping closer to yeah, him yeah I, I was talking about it uh, this uh, with him before the tourney started he was saying mm -hmm. Mario doesn't have to approach, so he approaches as least uh, as possible. He doesn't have to approach. That's what he said, uh, his philosophy with, with Mario. Mario doesn't have to approach. His words, not mine. Well, I believe him. I mean, he's the guy going 2-2 with Asriel right yeah. now, not me. He's basically thinking the only time I have to approach is when I'm at a deficit. Yeah, I can imagine that. And he is not at a deficit right now. And he is getting all these punishes. Oh, but that up here was ill-advised. We've seen him do it a, a, a lot of times mm -hmm. uh, in this tourney, but usually his reaction time is uh, a bit quicker than that. All right, both making it back. Cloud on the ledge. Yeah, no yep. snap, no invincibility. Then we'll get punished. Handily avoiding the flood with an air dodge, though, but he tries to land with an up air, gets punished by the up smash out of shield. Skipper looking primed to take losers finals. However, at 130%, your stock could be gone at any moment versus Cloud. Yeah, it's crunch time for Ezreal for oh. sure. Well, what, what, okay, what was that? Well, I know what that was. <laughs> that was an F tilt closing out that second stock. And man, 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 these why, guys are going head to head. Why, why is he going for back throw for there? Like, that, that's really ballsy sure to is, go for something so. That's just the type of players they are. I, I guess they are, because that is like super not guaranteed. Well, I'm glad And we're, we're talking about game five and losers finals last stock. Yeah. And right. again. 92, it, it's Skipper with all of the momentum in the world. Okay, Ezreal grabbing it, back, uh, taking it back by force. Off stage, oh. can he force him to use limit? No, no, he can't. Decides to go for the full charge on flood instead. Double jab, does not lead into F smash. All right, all right, just hopping around with these downers around him, but that F smash will catch him on the landing. Perfectly spaced. Yeah. So and the set goes three to two in favor of Skipper, which means he'll be meeting S1 in yeah. Grand Finals. Let's not forget that both of these players